Hey, what's going on everyone? Michael back with another video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up a scheduled weekly email in Power Automate. If you are new to the channel and aren't subscribed, feel free to subscribe. I make Power Automate, Power Apps, SharePoint, and Teams videos. And for my use case today, I'm going to be doing, if I'm working in HR and I need to set up an automate email for to send to my users to submit their payroll, payrolls every week. So let's get into it. All right. So in Power Automate, we will navigate to Create. And for this flow, we want to do a scheduled cloud flow because we can choose how often it runs. So for my test case, I'm doing payroll. Let's do payroll reminder to employees. Okay, so when do I want to start this flow? Let's start it. Let's say we have to submit your payroll on Sunday. So that'd be 9 11 today. And we will do 10 45. Just so in my use case, because this will get scheduled to run at 10 45. And uh, I want to have the example in the video. All right. So we will check off everything besides Sunday. So on Sunday every week at 10 45, this flow will run. All right, let's go to create. So just at the top, the first step is reoccurrence. If you click on edit, you can actually edit the um, intervals, the frequency, and all the other details. So take a look at that and see what you want to do. And for my operation, I want to do the connector will be send an email because I'm using Outlook. All right, there it is. Send an email v2 office 365 Outlook is the email connector I'll always use. So two, um, you can specify your employees or you can do a distribution list. It all depends on who you are sending the reminder to. For me, I'm just going to use my current user because that's what I'm logged into um, Outlook. Uh, for the subject, we'll do reminder, submit, payroll. Actually, we'll do submit timesheets because that sounds more appropriate for employees. In the body, you can do whatever you want. I'm just going to do, hey, everyone, please remember to submit your timesheets by 10.45 Sunday. Now that message, um, it's customizable. You can make it whatever you want for the purpose of this video. I'm just doing this. Actually, we'll do 11.59 because if I'm signing it at 10.45, it makes sense. Thanks, HR. We'll click on save. That's simple. And um, let me let me let me do a chat as well. I'll do a Teams message. So if you are working in a team environment and you don't want to send an email, an email you have everyone in the team, you can go ahead and do that. So it will be send a message. Hopefully. Post message in chat or channel Microsoft Teams. Um, I'm going to post as my user. You can do Flowbot if you want. I'm just going to do my user for now. Channel. Uh, let's send this to the marketing team and for the channel I already have a notifications channel so I'll be using that I'll just say hi hi everyone please remember to submit your timesheets by 11:59 p.m. thanks HR subject we will leave that blank but if you want to include that feel free I will click on save. Now, I don't feel like waiting till 1045 for this email to send and chat to send. So I'm going to manually trigger this flow. But um, the way I have it set up, it will trigger at 1045 as well. But for the sake of the video, I'm just going to do it now. So I'm just waiting for it to save. All right, flow is ready to go. So to run this flow, there is a button at the top. So if you want to run this flow outside the schedule time, you can actually click on this run button. I'm just going to do this for the purpose of the video. All right, flow is successfully ran. All right, so if it was 10.45, this is what would happen. As you can see, it's running right now. It succeeded. So we should be getting a notification in Teams and Outlook. So let's go ahead and check. All right, so we got our email. Hi, everyone. So as you can see, it's from me and it's going to me. Hi everyone, please remember to submit your timesheets by 11.59 Sunday. Thanks HR, a simple message, but it gets the point across. 
And let's go ahead and check teams. So I'm in the marketing team and the notifications channel because that's where I set it up. And as you can see, it is relaying my message. Hi everyone. Please remember to submit your timesheets by 11.59 p.m. Thanks, HR. We'll slap a like on that. And that is how you use scheduled flows in Power Automate. It's nice because if you send out emails every week, like, hey, what's going on? Um, yada, yada, yada. You can just automate it. If it's the same message over and over again, just automate it. It'll save you time. And if you, for, you won't have to worry about forgetting it. So that'll be a video for today. If you like the video, feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. If you have any video ideas, leave them in the comments below. And I will catch you in the next one.